Hi, this is Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal, and today we're going to be turning this bottle into a beautiful bottle with the minimal amount of decoration. So, let's get started. I really love the shape of this bottle. This originally is an olive oil bottle and I didn't want to throw it out. I wanted to save it and show you what I'm going to do with it. First, we're going to take we're going to paint it using this royal gold metallic paint and it's one of my favorites because it's really a bright bright gold paint. So it's, I think it's going to look really nice on this bottle. And then we're going to finish it off using this acrylic sealer from Aline's um, just to give it a nice high gloss finish. And we're going to use this ribbon, silk ribbon, to decorate it. And we're going to add some bling to it. We're first going to start by painting our bottle. And just by doing this now, I could already tell we're going to need to do more than one coat. Okay, so this is what it looks like with one coat. I'm going to apply another coat to it just to make it look really rich and vibrant. And then I'll come back and show you what it looks like. Okay, so our bottle is all done. And look at that nice shine that it has on it. It looks very regal and I really like the way that looks. I did add an extra shine on this um, by using the acrylic uh, sealer and gloss finish. So that gave it that extra shine, especially with the holidays coming up. Um, so now what I'm going to do is I've got my red satin ribbon and I'm just going to measure around this. And I just wanted to kind of mix up some color on this. I thought it would look nice with the gold and the red satin for some reason. I don't know, but um, I just like the way that looks. So I'm just measuring it just a little bit here. I'm gonna cut a little bit off here. I just want to overlap it just a little bit. I'm just going to put a little bit of glue right there. And this satin is very easy to, to stick with just a little bit of glue. And this is um this is going to be my back part of my bottle. And so I'm not too worried about it, but I do want to fold it under and make it look real pretty. So what I'm going to do is just add a tiny bit of glue right there. And I'm just going to fold this cuz I want it to look neat. And you see what I'm doing? So I just gave that little fold by hot gluing it. And I want to just pull this tight, a little bit tighter. Just 
just using a tiny bit of this. I don't want to use too much on there. I like to go back and just put little dots in here. Just so it stays on. Okay, now if I turn this over, I'm going to take this now and just kind of layer it with this. Look how pretty that is. This is the um, diamond wrap. And um, I got this gold wrap from the Dollar Tree. Look how pretty that is. Just adding that little bit over the red. I really like that. I'm just going to turn this over so I can measure it out here. And the nice thing about this is that you can cut little pieces away um, so it doesn't have to be, you don't have to use the whole thing. You can cut little parts of it and use just tiny parts. So I am definitely going to go back. This is a must buy and a good thing to have in your stash. I'm just lining that up just to make sure. Right about there. And that's super easy to cut. Nice way to add jewels to your to your decor, and I'm just coming right along there. I'm gonna let that dry for a little bit. And then I'm going to put the other one up this way. Let's see if I need to put a little bit of hot glue right here, because I want it to be centered. I want it to kind of be still. Won't hurt to put some right here too. And this looks so pretty. Just let that stay on there for a little bit. And look how that looks so gorgeous. Just adding that little bit over the red. I hope I can really catch that so you can see. Try to face it toward the light so you can really see what that looks like. That is absolutely pretty. And so this actually has a top to it. And so what I decided is to take the top. I'm going to leave the top on this. Um, on this bottle. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go around this edge here and add a little bit of gold to that also. I'm just measuring around and I'm going to cut. Wow, that looks good already. I could tell this is going to be really nice. And I think it's because the top is gold also. Makes it look really, really regal. And look how pretty that is when you fit it on top here. Wow. Very nice. And another, just another idea if you want to. You can just lay it right on the gold without the ribbon and that'll kind of balance it out. With the top being gold too and that bottom. 
That is going to be really pretty. And just measuring that out. Send it right about there. This looks like it's going to go a pretty long way because it's, let's see, it's nine feet of diamond, they call it diamond wrap. It's nine feet of diamond wrap. So that's a really good amount. You can decorate several bottles or containers. Just depends on what you want. And I'm just going to keep this as my back part here. Put a little bit of glue on there. So make sure you keep those olive oil bottles because that's an upcycle project. I'm just leaving a little bit just around the edge there at the bottom. But if you want to go all the way up to the edge, you could. And you really can't see the hot glue underneath this. And I mean, you could use this to decorate for the holidays. Um, you could use this all year round. Um, you could mix up colors. You don't have to do it in gold. You can paint it a different color. Or you could just leave it clear, actually, if you wanted to. So tell me how you would use this. Um, I would probably use this as some kind of table decor. But you could use it on a nightstand also. You just have to tailor the colors to however you would want. But this, to me, would be something like um, possibly holiday or Christmas. But it could be for whatever you want. And look how pretty that is. And it's all done. And that's just a quick and easy upcycle. Um, I love sharing these ideas because I just love decorating bottles and reusing them. So thanks so much for joining me. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. And I'll see you real soon. Happy crafting. Bye. Okay, so one more thing. Say your bottle is all done and you just want to add something else, just a little more sparkle to it. All you have to do is take a strip and just starting right over here, you just run that right down, right down the middle there. And that just gives you a little bit more sparkle. So I'm going to go ahead and glue that on just to show you real quick. And you don't have to do this, but I just want to give you another option. All right, and look how pretty that is. That just gives it a little bit more shine. Just one more idea.